in this uh, chapter uh, which is uh, circulation in animals the most important aspect is cardiac cycle cardiac cycle is uh, the sequence of events occurs during one heartbeat the duration of the cycle is 0.8 second it means in every 0.8 uh, second the cycle is repeated point since we know uh, in one minute heart beats about 72 times therefore uh, one cycle stands for 0.8 second this diagram represent the cardiac cycle this is in fact diagrammatic representation of cardiac cycle in this diagram we can see uh, there are two rings outer ring and inner ring outer ring is uh, ventricular cycle inner ring is atrial cycle in both the rings certain uh, sections are shaded and uh, some are unshaded the shaded division represent systole or contraction of the heart during uh, which uh, the heart ejects blood unshaded division represent diastole of the heart now you see in ventricular cycle uh, that is in outer ring there are three un three shaded division it represent ventricular systole we have uh, uh, eight intersections of uh, each uh, ring uh, and each intersection represent 0.1 second so in ventricular cycle there are three shaded division which represents systole so ventricular systole time is 0.3 second followed by five unshaded division in outer ring which represent ventricular diastole so total cycle is point of uh, 0.8 second ventricular cycle similarly atrial cycle in inner ring we can see there is one shaded division which represent atrial systole 0.1 second followed by seven unshaded division uh, which represent atrial diastole so total duration of atrial cycle is also 0.8 second 0.8 second atrial cycle 0.8 second ventricular cycle total duration of cycle is also is of 0.8 second how atrial cycle atrial atrial systole and ventricular systole does not overlap so we uh, we take its time separately atrial systole 0.1 second ventricular systole 0.3 second but we see overlapping here 1 2 3 and 4 this is called joint diastole which stands for 0.8 second so total duration of cycle is also 0.8 second this cycle is called one heartbeat so one heartbeat means there is one atrial systole, one ventricular systole, and one joint diastole. And in one uh, heartbeat, the total time this is taken is 0.8 second. This is called one cardiac cycle time. Now, what happens uh, in one cardiac cycle? We, if you start cycle from here, this uh, point is uh, the point where atrioventricular valve closed. Atrioventricular valve closed atrioventricular valve the valve which is found in between atria and ventricle it is tricuspid in uh, right side and bicuspid on left side when this valve closed it produces a sound called love sound what is nature of love sound nature of love sound is it is low pitched it is low pitched and of longer duration it sounds like love when atrioventricular valve closed ventricle starts contraction and during contraction of ventricle blood ejects from ventricle into corresponding arteries means blood of right side goes to pulmonary artery and of left side goes to aorta total uh, systolic time of ventricle is 0.3 second after 0.3 second the semilunar valve closed semilunar valve closed it produces second heart sound it is called top it is of high pitch and of shorter duration like top then after completion of uh, ventricular systole atrial systole uh, sorry ventricular diastole starts this from this point we can see uh, this is diastolic phase of atria this is also diastolic phase of uh, ventricle so diastolic phase of both atria and ventricle uh, continues 
till 4 second 1 2 3 and 4 this is called as joint diastole as soon as joint diastole is completed atria contracts this contraction leads to ejection of blood from atria to ventricle it completes again when ventricle uh, when atria contracts blood flows into ventricles the pressure of ventricle goes above atrial pressure again atrial ventricular valve is closed and initiates a new cycle so uh, for completing one cycle how much time is taken 0.8 second this is normal condition but if we are doing uh, some physical activity an external physical activity the duration of cycle is decreased in resting stage how much blood ejects from blood per minute this per minute value is 5 to 6 liter and it is called cardiac output stroke volume is the amount of blood which is ejected from blood in one beat the so one beat during one beat 70 ml blood is ejected from blood so one minute we can multiply 70 into uh, 60 uh, it comes around 5 to 6 liter in resting is resting condition but if you are doing exercise both stroke volume as well as cardiac output increases this relation when heart rate uh, this relation uh, relationship between heart rate and systemic blood pressure is called as Mary's law of heart when heart rate is more it causes vasodilation blood pressure decreases when heart rate is less it causes vasoconstriction and blood pressure is increased so heart rate and systemic blood pressure have inverse relationship this inverse relationship is called Mary's law of heart heart size depends on body size means larger the size of body larger the size of heart so in animal kingdom we can see uh, in terrestrial animals uh, elephants have a largest size heart but heart size and heart rate have inverse relationship means larger is the size of heart less is the heart rate in case of elephant the heart rate is 25 beats per minute if we compare uh, heart rate in males and females in human being because in females heart size is slightly less so heart rate is slightly more 